Hello everyone, welcome back! I'm MCBOK, here to guide you on your journey to smarter finances. Ready to take the next step? <laughs> Let's go! We see numbers every single day. When those numbers come together, they reveal the flow of the economy. The more complex the economy gets, the more we need statistics. Because statistics are the mirror that shows us the real picture. Now, how can we look into the mirror in a smarter way? You're already seeing them every day in the news, online, even on TV. The growth rate, the inflation rate, the base interest rate, or the exchange rate. Have you ever paused for a moment when those came up in the news? That's why we're here. Once you know how to read the numbers, you'll use it for life. The best place to learn is on the Bank of Korea's very own platform. Say hello to Echoes, the statistics platform run by the Bank of Korea. Since it's run by Central Bank, you can trust that it's both accurate and reliable. Let's check out Echoes together! Just search for Bank of Korea Echoes and you'll find it right away. Or click the Echoes link at the top left of the English language Bank of Korea website. On the Echoes main screen, you'll see seven main menu sections. There is search stat, statistics by theme, release calendar, and others. Below those in the middle, under the search window, you'll see nine label icons by statistical theme and five icons that can each give you an economic overview of the Korean economy. Then, in the bottom right, there are the daily indicators, real-time market updates that show you interest rate, exchange rates, and stock index all right there at a glance. Let's dive in. All right, ready to dig into some statistics? Echoes organizes its statistics like a tree. Click through the top menus, follow the branches step by step, and you'll land right on the data you're looking for. Not sure which category it's under? <laughs> no worries. Just type your keyword into the search bar at the top. Click down to select the sub item, hit quick view at the bottom. The time series results pop right up. Are you seeing too many extra subcategories on the screen? <laughs> Easy fix. Go back and reselect your sub item, i.e., don't click on quick view yet. In the setup column, uncheck the Select All tab and just select the boxes you actually want or use Level Select to narrow it down. And then you can hit Quick View at the bottom for clean, focused results. Want to see more than one statistic at the same time? That's when the blue Add to List option at the bottom is your best choice. Since so you're looking up the M2 Abroad money supply instead of hitting Quick View, save it with the Add to List option. Then grab the Consumer Price Index the same way. Now, both the M2 and the CPI sit side by side in your list. Now click view list and BAM! You've got them on the same screen. <laughs> Easy, right? On the results screen, you don't just see the time series. You also get details like the most recent update date, the coverage period, footnotes, and sources, all in one glance. If you need a different view, you can change options like the time range on the units. Customize it the way you want. You can even rearrange how table looks. By default, it's a horizontal view. However, if you pick vertical view, the time series flows from top to bottom. Want the latest numbers first? Just click sort by desktop. Now the freshest data shows up right at the first. Numbers by themselves are cool, but the real magic happens when you compare them across time. That's how you catch the flow, the trends, and the big picture. Check out the original data box above the table. You can pick how to look at it, quarter to quarter, year over year, or against the base period. Choose the analysis style that works for you. You can download the results as a file or just highlight the range you need, copy, and drop it straight into Excel. Are you more into charts than tables? Mm, no problem. Click on the chart tab. You can pick the type of chart like a line or a bar chart. Now, at the very top of the original Agus website, let's check out the Statistics by Theme drop-down menu. Here you can dive into one of three subcategories, the 100 key indicators, regional statistics, and the financial and economic snapshot are neatly grouped by topic. First up, the 100 key indicators think of this section as the highlight reel of the national economy, with the key 100 statistics here giving you a big picture view, all in one tap, complete with graphs and the latest data. Click on any indicator and you'll see its most recent trend right away. Next, regional statistics. Echoes bundles regional statistics and local data into themes like deposits, loans, and discounts, assets, household economy, or enterprise. So, you can explore your regional area's local economy from different angles. 
if you're curious about hot topics like corporate laws, household laws, delinquency rates, consumer sentiment, or business outlook. Look at the regional economic status column on the left. There you'll find all the data lined up, one after the other. For the Bank of Korea, keeping prices stable is the key to a healthy national economy. To steer the policy, it needs to make sharp, accurate judgments. That's why the bank sells complex core statistics like the national income and the monetary aggregates. At the top of the Echo's main page, you'll see the major statistics explanation menu section. Here you can get a detailed explanation about the major statistics produced and released by the Bank of Korea, plus definitions of important terms and even FAQs all in one place. On the right side, the recently released publication sections gives you access to press releases. There are also video explainers ready for you to use, perfect for anyone who wants to dig deeper. So there's a full tour of the Bank of Korea's Echo's economic statistics system. Here's the key takeaway. Economic statistics are more than just numbers. They are a mirror that reflects where the domestic economy stands today and a compass that points toward tomorrow. Use statistics to read the economy around you with ease and to make smarter choices with the data you can get from our Echo's website. So, what are you waiting for? Go and check out the indicators that interested you right now at Echo's. <laughs>